The game changes already. Let's bring them in. The next Titan Nigeria Season 9. The next Titan Nigeria Season 9 is brought to you by Luno. In association with Heritage Bank and Tingo Mobile. The audition team of the next Titan arrived in Port Harcourt full of expectation. Looking at the crowd that turned up for the audition, a distinct feeling seemed to register that the oil-rich city wasn't intending to lag behind any other. We are in the beautiful garden city of Port Harcourt and accreditation is done. Time for the contestants to do a thing or two for us. But before that, let's check how excited they are. Contestants in Port Harcourt, are you ready? Yeah! Oh my understands the Potako people, they know they agree. They know they, uh, they, they carry last. <laughs> so bring the A game on, man. Super excited, happy for the very first contestant going in to meet the judges right now. How do you feel? Uh, I'm sorry, I actually do feel nervous, but it's a game and I'm ready to be the game changer. All right. Tell us about your business idea. Okay, my business idea is centered on logistics and warehousing. I need you to relax. Okay, so Omaji Designs is a women's wear brand that creates dresses that can be worn in multiple ways. Can you show us two ways? All right. Let's assume I have to go to a club or I need something simpler. I could choose to wear this as a crop top. Okay. And Perfect. then I could choose to take off the sleeves Wait behind. Uh, what do you need money for? Okay, what we need money for is probably to build and market the app, and it's going to just cost um, seven hundred thousand. Yeah. Okay, my business idea is basically to um, empower locals that are already in the production of palm oil. Now I'm from a dope state, and that's what we do. That's the only thing we know. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Not no beats me. Uh -huh. I no, no, no. Uh -huh. You will have our attention. You even made us angry. We also We're thinking angry of, we want now. to support you now. Thank you, sir. To see how we can support you. Don't know from the bro. But it will make you more upset. Just wait. <laughs> <laughs> Where should I wait? Just wait behind. <laughs> OK. Wait behind. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have resources to fund a bar. What of uh, agriculture? <laughs> no. <laughs> have one minute to summarize your entire business idea. Don't tell us stories, no statistics. Go ahead, summarize in one minute, one after the other. At the Master Keys and More, we make beautiful clothes for not just the small size women, but the plus size and the first trimming size, first trimming size, pregnancy, women. Uh, Thank you. Next person. The major problem of coconut water lovers is the risk of standing by the roadside to drink coconut water. So we came up with an idea of bottling and packaging our coconut flavored coconut water with coconut meat. So we are now in major supermarket and then we need the Eddie Eddie Husking machine. Thank you. And a vehicle. If only participation could guarantee selection. After a deluge of presentations through the day. The dreaded but inevitable time came to announce the names of those advancing beyond the original edition stage. Hello, guys. Hi. Uh, we're going to make it very quick. What we're about to do right now is uh, the judges have decided. And so we'll be announcing the names of the people that have made it, that have made it on this list. 
So either I call your name, you make it to the booth down, please wait behind. If you do not hear your name, still wait behind for the white card, okay? Zero four six. Please step forward. Time to separate the man from the boys. Congratulations, zero two four. You made it to the boot camp. Judges, fantastic job picking those who are going to Lagos. So I need you to help me pick that wild card right now. Are you ready? Ready. My magic number is one, two, two. Zero, four, zero. I know why it's one, five. Wow. So once again, a big congratulations to all of you, a round of applause. You've all done well. You've all shown, you've shown tenacity. And um, we're hoping that you don't disappoint us as the show goes on. Thank you once again. We are the from But our good auditions came to a close after having attended to the large crowd of aspiring moguls. Will the Garden City produce the next Titan? Only time will tell. the Federal Capital Territory, Abuja. This is the next Titan season nine. Abuja, are you ready? Yeah! The next Titan was well received in the seat of power by the vibrant lot that made it to the Abuja auditions. Do you feel the game changer is going to be from Abuja this season, season nine, next Titan? Yeah, I think we started well. I'm liking the energy. Abuja, are you here? Yeah! So real quick, do you feel this idea that you're pitching to the judges is the game changer plan or game changer idea that will make them give you a yes? Of course it is because we are working on improving nutrition in Nigeria. So I think for me, you from the first time, you're a well put together guy. You know, soft spoken, but you know what you're doing. You know your business and I know this pitch, so I'm not going to waste my time. Yeah. You're back with the same business. Did you so, make it to the bootcamp? Yes, I did. Uh -huh. okay, so yeah, it's, uh, camp, it's yeah. uh, just wait. Just wait. Yeah. Thank you so much, sir. Right. Okay, I create luxury brand for the high, the mighty, and tasteful individuals. How much would what you're wearing cost on a good 80,000. 80,000. So where do we come in? Yes. I need that phone because I want to expand my business. How many staff do you have right now? Eight. How much is your revenue in a year? In a year, monthly, I make 300 to 400. I need the money. <laughs> Different kinds of reaction trailed the verdicts of the judges. All in all, it was as delightful as it was almost bizarre. The search for that bright idea, not surprisingly, will always be full of diverse encounters. Kudos to Abuja. However, the city did not disappoint. How are you doing, guys? Are you ready? Zero three two, step into the box. Your one minute begins now. I convert agro waste to domestic fuel. Two major problems this will solve is deforestation and environmental pollution. Thank you. Thank you. It didn't take too long for the judges to realize that some contestants were clearly not on the same page as the show. We finally arrived at the destination and uh, we're about to give the verdict. But then um, after this, once we announce the people that have been able to, that have made it to the boot camp in this group, the rest should still wait outside because we have three white cards. What that means is that it's a sort of ballot system, a randomly selected number. So you must still be lucky that your name is in the white card, just in case if you don't make it. Uh, for this group, not everybody made it to the boot camp. 058, step four. After a full day of presentations, it comes to the time for the verdict. 
the announcement of the names of those that will be invited to Lagos to slug it out with other shortlisted contestants from other regions. The guys in the front, congratulations, you made it to the boot camp. Right now, we have to activate the wild cards. Are you ready to pick? Yes, we are. I picked card one. The last number is five. Yes! <laughs> so I think it's 105. Yeah. Congratulations. Zero, zero, nine. Oh. Congratulations. How are you doing, guys? Excited. Are you feeling like winners now? Yes. yes! Are you feeling like conquerors? Yes, sir. Yes. Feeling very victorious. Yes. Right, but your voices are not loud enough. We are the From the south, north, east, and now finally in the west, this is Nigeria's number one entrepreneur reality TV show, The Next Titan. We are excited as we are in the buzzing city that everybody talks about and never sleeps. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Lagos. Let's begin the auditions of season nine, The Next Titan. Come with us. So what are you bringing to the table for the judges today? I'm bringing something very creative, something very unique, and something very new. My unique selling point is to give other African students opportunities around schools around Africa, um, opportunities around a lot of different things. Lagos, are you ready? So what are you expecting from Lagos today? Um, Lagos is a city filled with brilliant minds, so I'm looking forward to innovative ideas. As you can tell, I'm excited. I mean, from experience, Lagos has some of the best minds, brilliant, innovative. That's what I'm looking for. Well, I'm rooting for Lagos already, because I'm a Lagosian. So, I mean, you know what's up? <laughs> Basically pitched my company, which is the creative brand, like I mentioned, On Fire Visuals. Hi, my name is Eric Anthony. So my company, On Fire Studios, we're a very unique company, right? We render um, on-demand video editing services to YouTubers and influencers. We allow you to share your pain, your stories, your strengths, weaknesses, and also response to failure. So Mr. Pinegal, you can actually get onto the platform, register, and take courses that moves you from point one, from zero to point one. So if I ask you to like give you a role, you can act it out now? Oh, I can act very well. I'm a very good actor. Let's try it. Okay, let's let's. I think we're done. I think yeah. Esther is even the actor. Yeah. is the better actor. <laughs> so I think you you, have, you even agree. <laughs> yeah, I'm a better director. Just when you think you've seen it all, someone shows up and succeeds in proving otherwise. Oski Group controls the entire value chain of catfish. We produce three products for catfish at the moment. Um, this is one of our products that is now tax certified and FDA certified, ready to export to the United States of America. This product is um, kids friendly and adult friendly. Thank you. Next person. Okay, I'm in the beauty and cosmetics industry and we've been able to identify problems and working on the solution. But beyond the problems and the solution, we're looking at sustainability. Thank you. Thank you. At Scofield Creativity, we operate with the conviction to deliver bespoke suits and clients to our bespoke clients who are based in Nigeria and locally. And we also like provide them with quality tunics and shirts, which will help them look good looking from, from time to time and also in their Thank you. Okay, there's a situation where we're all tired of manual car wash. My, the, my idea is to, it, we have an automated car wash that that eradicates the, the long line, the queues of weight for manual car wash. So you have two minutes wash. But it's all incorporated into the idea of IoT, where you also have apps that you can control your cars from, keeping it safe, where your cars cannot be stolen anymore. That's the generation we're moving to. Thank, Thank you. you. Next person. 
24-hour supermarkets and pharmacies is an absolute necessity in Nigeria. That is why I opened and run these businesses. Now, having a support from the Titan system would allow me to expand into other fruitful economies and create a quality of life for other people within a 10 to 15 kilometer radius. I've already been able to turn over 200 plus million naira in one and a half years by myself. Thank you I'm so sure much. with this system I can do more. Next person. Hi, my name is Oluwa Dayami Paul. My company is Fresh Air. We produce consumer grade autonomous sanitization drones for homes and offices. This is an appliance level thing. It's not a service, it's not an expensive product. This is the retails around $300 and it's a plug and play. After deliberations, the audition judges came up with the Lagos shortlist. The successful few that would leap for joy upon hearing their names called among those proceeding to the next stage of the contest. So it's good you're expectant. So I just want to say congrats to you guys. You guys have done well. You've made it to this stage. Um, so we're going to call the names of those of you who have made it to the boot camp. But if you don't hear your name by any chance, we have something we'll call the wild card. 304. The successful few that will live for joy upon hearing their names called among those proceeding to the next stage of the contest. This task, even for the judges, cannot possibly be easy. Congratulations, you made it to the boot camp. Congrats. Me too. Yeah. <laughs> the competition was fierce. Lagos did not disappoint. You've made the right decision with the people you've picked, but it's time for us to activate the wild card. Are we ready? Yes, we are. So I think I have 093 with me. Zero four nine. Oh wow, female. It was indeed a humongous task for the judges to decide and however Herculean it is, the decision has to be made and it was made. We are From Lagos, these are the selected game changers going to the boot camp. from the east as the journey has traversed north, south, west, and now the east. Game changer to my right, are you ready? Yeah. To my left, are you ready? Yeah. Let the game changers make a loud noise! Oh. Okay, Manuel, what's your business idea? Um, I want to talk about um, basically cooking oil cream production. Okay. That's my business idea. Okay. I have two business ideas. Are you already producing? Yes, sir. Where's the perfume? I don't have a perfume. You did, you, but you still produce it? Why didn't you bring it? The name of my company is Buddha on the digital network of the And the aim of the company is to simplify access to basic digital services and solutions. This is gas. So this is a prototype you designed yourself? Yes. Did you design it yourself? Yes, I designed it. Okay. Um, 005, that's Prince. Wait behind, we'd like to talk to you again. Oh, you catch here. Sir. Your idea is not clear. All right, but we'll give you one more chance later to say it. If you can't say what you are selling in a minute, it's probably not your idea or you haven't just thought about it very well. It's not a good pitch, but you are smart and it looks like you have a good solution. So please wait behind. But while you are pitching the second time, please ensure you get it in one minute. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Um, Kingsley, we think your idea is a laudable one. It's a good one, but um, it's not something that we can support at this time. It's not in line with what we're looking for, oh. right? Probably next year. Well, thank you very much for your time. Only the best can be selected, and the judges did what they know best. Okay, so we're moving on to 
to the next phase. Uh, we are all going to pitch your ideas once again. Summarize real quick. 30 seconds, one minute. Go ahead. The time starts now. Uh, my company, EDU Films, will be uh, creating and filling up the vacuum of content which is needed in Nigeria. So I'm going to use your five million and break it down to four different places. Five million, and I'll be making three, uh, 1.5 million uh, with every three months. That's just by selling one movie. So just imagine if I was to sell that one movie to two platforms, I'll be making you nothing less than six million off just a quarter of your 20 million. Thank you so, so much, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. To find the word innovation, Solving the problem of unemployment, poverty, decent working, in the field of arts and crafts. We create, incubate, empower entrepreneurs while, create, while producing our brand okay. products. Thank you. Next, Next person. From here, the collation is done, and here are the finalists from Enugu. Once again, guys, um, I want you to put your hands together for yourselves. It's been an interesting process for you guys. Uh, it's always a pleasure working with smart young people who are innovative and doing big things. So we're about to take decisions on uh, who moves to the boot camp, right? If for some reason you don't hear your name, we have something called the Wildcard. The Wildcard is sponsored by Heritage Bank. So if you don't hear your name, you may just be lucky and be on the list for the Wildcard. 086. 088. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, 048. You made it to the bootcamp. Congratulations. So I'm about to pick. Any number I pick will definitely make it to the bootcamp. The number I pick is 015. them and every other shortlisted contestants bootcamp training is the next call the next titan nigeria season 9 is brought to you by luno in association with heritage bank and tingo mobile bootcamp training is the next call Yeah, my name is Steve Emmanuel. I auditioned in Enugu State. I'm a gift curator. I run a digital gift market where people can shop various gifts across the world, like an Amazon for the gift space in Africa. Whoa. Next Titan Bootcamp experience. It's been exciting for me. Very exciting. The best part of the Bootcamp has been the people. I've met a lot of incredible people and also to the productions. I auditioned in Abuja. I'm a confident, smart Northern woman. I'm here to break the bias and glass to tell Northern ladies who are conservative that they can be do it and have it. Who amongst us is the game changer? They get up early in the morning to exercise to help them become alert. Let's do this. Let's do this. experience has been exhilarating. I met a lot of awesome creatives. I had fun and I learned a lot. It's been tough but totally worth it. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, uh, Best part of the boot camp for me will have to be the sports, the exercise and the uh, uh, special people coming to give us special talks. What makes me different from every other consultant Firstly, I think I'm the only one who received a scholarship to the number one university in the world at 22. One of the purposes of the boot camp is to expose contestants to valuable learning opportunities. My expectation is actually to get into the house. This is my fourth time coming for the boot camp. While at the boot camp, contestants receive guests that come to motivate them. From day one, if you want to win, don't lose. I'll describe myself as a game changer because I always think outside the box. You are not reinventing the wheel. 
you are not giving us what everybody you need to give something that is different and also enlighten them on some important aspects of business and personal attitude that would be of great benefit to them i represent what it means to be a game changer i've been doing this since i was 13. i have been hustling and doing great businesses since i was young the fact that your friends your neighbors your relations got that job that very wonderful job does not mean that you are not good. It simply shows that what something better is ahead. I will describe myself as a game changer. I have fresh ideas that the world is yet to see. Well, I'd say it's a very, it has been a very interesting activity so far, and I'm actually having fun. As a team lead, when your team loses a task, you will not take responsibility. Ah, uh, that's not when if, if if you're not somebody who takes responsibility, the judges will see it from your communication and that's the only clue they need they would need to throw you out. They begin to appreciate one another and also start to bond. First, I auditioned at the great city of Port Harcourt, and I am Israel Chigo Zirim, and I represent over 300 million farmers who produce 10 times less in Africa. I represent their struggles, and I represent the struggle of Africa. My name is Fasone Afolabi. I auditioned in Lagos. I am a commercial food and portrait photographer, and also a chef. This camp story from the day of arrival is what I would like to call a mind for me because I have been through a very close situation from work. I'm always working. Since I came here, I've been able to relate to more people and be able to have different other social experiences. This is like my highlight here. This is my second boot camp. Now, and I'll say this is different from the one I came the last time. My name is Ronald Chako Ebelobi. I represent an automotive automobile brand. Audition in Lagos. My name is Oscar Michael, founder of Africa Communicate. And I'm a passionate creative entrepreneur, determined on making a change in the industry. The journey begins here. It is now time to discover how effectively contestants can function as members of a group. It was very interesting to see how creative they were in the space of how many minutes they needed to come up with something really different. And it was very interesting that they were able to tie their business idea to some of the presentation, the stories and everything that was created. We are Titans! I go by the name Master Alamipo Aladinjoye, and I am here to defend the motion which states I oppose dodo in our economy. This man is full of surprises. <laughs> but why did you put the dodo in his mouth like that? <laughs> and my role in the presentation, I came into the presentation to buttress a point. They are to carry out their assignments and afterwards hear the judges' assessment of their performances. I did see a lot of synergy in that, in that part. Aside from that, I think it was really good. I want you to mess and make me feel like a man. Let me perceive the smell that comes out of the rectal hole. Well, I don't know who wrote the script, but the message was passed appropriately. Yes, my group presentation was one that uh, was um, 
was inspiring in the sense that it encouraged people um, that listen to us to uh, understand that entrepreneurship is the only solution to the problem of Nigeria and Africa today. Your group scored 15, you came 10. So you came 7, 18, you came 8. You scored 22.8, you came third, 23.8, you came second. Group 10, you have emerged the winners of this competition. Bootcamp, I think I'm looking forward to better pitches from the participants. I mean, um, after the auditions, there were a series of uh, advices that we had for them. I told them, you know, how to make their presentations better. I'm founder of Omasiena Organic Beauty. Omasiena Organic is a manufacturing company. We manufacture natural hair care products, such as natural shampoo, um, hair growth oils, um, koi creams and um, softness. Goshika Cake Company is an edible art and dessert company. I know you're very familiar with my, the way I like to describe my business as turning sugar and chocolate into edible pieces, to real pieces of edible art. My name is Zina Ramsey. I am a co-founder of Share Vista TV Entertainment, we are into movie production, and we have our movie distributed on our YouTube channel where we have about 11 million subscribers. Berry tomato is 100% farm fresh quality tomatoes packaged in a jar. It doesn't need to be refrigerated, it doesn't have any chemicals or any preservatives, and it has a shelf life of one year. What we do as Elitron is that we have a generative space for artists to explore their creative ability. We help them make money and we also help them to, like, we encourage them to impact society. I am the founder of Katso Designs. Katso Designs is a registered leather product manufacturing company. We are into the business of crafting durable footwear, bags, and other leather accessories. So I used to own a blog, like, way back so it, it's just been a name that has been it's been a household name so i just started to maintain it good evening judges i'm Orolo wakinto i'm a beauty entrepreneur and i'm the founder of the gloss of soul nigeria right now we have 20 producers registered on our website so i'm the um, founder of manga Manga is an agri-fintech app, a startup company that simulates the experience of the Airbnbs and the Uber to connect um, agro-food vendors. My name is Noratu Choma Eluma. I'm a musician and I'm also the founder of a company called Electron Management and Entertainment Limited. So what we do is that we have a space, a generative space that allows artists to express themselves the range of their creative ability. I'm a fashion designer and my business is more like into thinking um, sense of fashion. Now that boot camp is over, finally the day has arrived. On this day that will become a memorable one for all 66 contestants. It's all glitz and glamour at the ballroom of the Lagos Continental Hotel, Victoria Island, Lagos, venue of the premiere of the next Titan season nine. Now that the boot camp training is fully accomplished, the surest but next destination is the next Titan House. However, there is a proviso to that in terms of space. It can only accommodate 18 contestants. And who will be the lucky 18? Celebration is in the air.
contestants will enter into the next Titan House today to commence a journey that will culminate with one of them emerging as the next Titan, aka the Game Changer. It is indeed reason enough to be excited. I want to bring up the executive producer of the next Titan TV show, Mr. Mide Kunle Akindaja. Okay, okay, okay. On behalf of our sponsors and partners, I'm glad to welcome you all to this premier show evening to kick off the season nine, tag the game changer of the next Titan Nigeria. The sponsors and supporters of the show are also here to usher the 18 into the next Titan house and to give words of encouragement and much needed direction. So you guys are an inspiration. You are showing courage and resilience, especially where we live. You are doing the best that you can do, and I'm really impressed, and I really hope that we have here the best and have the best for all of you. Please note, today is actually the beginning of the best days for the rest of your life. The audience was treated to a night of rib-cracking jokes, musical renditions, and artist performances. My money. Thank you very much. We are already partners with you, and our doors are open for us to do business together in terms of technology. We enjoin them to seize this platform and utilize the opportunities it presents to create possibilities for themselves and others, and by so doing, contribute significantly towards the long-term development of this country. CFAX Group will continue to support uh, this event. Let's rise in unison to transform Africa by creating jobs. So I must commend the organizers of the show for producing this wonderful show, and this has really had more value to our co to our company, and we, we really thank you for that. Love, love, say, caro your body necessary, oh yeah. Say, caro carry the story. Say, caro they make my head, caro they make my head, caro they make my head. Say, caro they make my head. I'm looking for Caro. Show me Caro. Oh, yes, you see Caro. Where are you, Caro? I'm looking for Caro. I love you. Oh, the show was indeed lit. Ladies and gentlemen, I ask you to please watch the proper introduction of our Academy judges. Just fix your eyes on the screen as we properly introduce them. My name is Lilian Olubi, and I'm a judge in the next Titan Nigeria season nine. Stay tuned. Being an entrepreneur these days in Nigeria is extremely difficult. It's demanding. It needs 24-7. My advice is take some time out to relax and enjoy your life and reflect. That time doesn't have to be drinking, it can be sports, it can be anything, but clear the mind. My case at my age, I can sit back and relax, but it's important to you to progress and have time to think. Cheers, and I wish, wish you the very best of luck. And to the next Titan, Series 9, best of luck to all of you, because you're under extra pressure. Cheers. So I think uh, we will all agree that these are very critical times uh, in our nation. And I think in this season, more than ever before, apart from passion that we always want to see, 
Um, I think I'm looking forward to seeing people who understand the value that their businesses will bring to nation building, who would um, sort of be able to, you know, bring businesses that inspire and empower, you know, and that will be true game changers. Have we revealed the host for this season? Hello, my name is Stephanie Koka at Dira no Kuma. I am a TV host, an actor, producer, entrepreneur, and children's author. We are going to discover so many talents on this season of The Next Titan. Okay, I would like to invite our audition judges, our boot camp judges, Ronald, Chike and Timmy Tokbe, please join me on stage to unveil our top finalists. While the audition judges presented the bootcamp finalist, it is time to unveil our top 18 titans, the game changers. Celine Wazuki, please step on stage. What we selected based on our judgment is a function of uh, the pool of applicants that we had. We we'll think among these people, there is definitely a game changer. And then I think the boardroom judges are gonna be impressed. I think whoever wins eventually deserve the prize. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you our 18 titans that will be entering the house, the season nine house, the game changers. Congratulations to our top 18. Finally. arrive at the next Titan house tucked away in a Lagos suburb. They are exhausted, not surprisingly, but relieved and excited all the same. They have come to the place where the real battle will take place. But for now, they need to savour their first victory, having been selected out of the 66 that made it to the boot camp. Settled into the Titan house, relaxed and thankful for their selection, Stephanie, the show host, paid a cutsy visit to the house. She was received with such warmth that melts the heart. Coincidentally, the contestants were thrashing out house matters. Her grand entrance brought the desired respite to the almost tensed atmosphere. Stephanie Coker, surely a woman of many parts, reeled out her many accomplishments so and in turn like requested that each participant share their details and what fueled their yeah, passion for business. Winning nuggets were also discussed, what to do in the event of nomination, how to bounce back, and many questions were asked as she did justice to them. All right, so I have to leave now, but I will be taking you guys up on your offer of the food next time I visit. After all said okay. and done, all it right. was time to say goodbye, but not without her patting shots while the contestants saw her out of the house, knowing that when next they set their eyes on the host, she will be delivering the first task for the Bodrum business. Bye. 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 The next Titan Nigeria Season 9 is brought to you by Luno in association with Heritage Bank and Tingo Mobile.